any day now we're going to be able to watch the official season six battle royale trailer now in today's video i'm going to be showing you the leaked release date of when you can watch it and where you need to go to watch this trailer the season six trailer as well as a fan-made official trailer which i honestly think is absolutely epic we're going to be taking a look at that so today's video if you're interested in season six you just want to know everything there is to know about season six and how things around the map are changing because right now the fortnite map is a dangerous place things are going down left right and center and you guys need to be making sure you're caught up so you understand the storyline and you know what's about to go down so today's video i've got you guys covered make sure you drop a like and let's get straight into it so as we are only a week away from the new season six i am going to begin my battle pass giveaways for fortnite season six now if you're watching this video and you want to get a free battle pass before the season even arrives all you have got to do to get entered into the battle pass giveaway is to drop a like here on the video make sure you are subscribed and turn on post notifications and then complete it by commenting anything you want down below you can literally just comment good vid or what's up higgs or hashtag season six or hashtag battle pass comment absolutely anything you want down below to confirm you've done all of the previous steps and you will have a chance of winning a free fortnite battle pass for season six get into the trailer i just wanted to start this video off by going through everything that's going on around the map that is an indication to what's how season five is going to end the big event that we're going to be seeing at the end of the season and also how season six is going to look in terms of map changes in terms of the style the battle pass the types of skins so let's jump into that before we do anything else now of course loot lake which i honestly think is crazy i think this is one of the best changes that's gone down so far uh with the loot lake actually fully changing and being this complete bounce pad it was actually cool i'll show you a quick clip now but in on stream i was getting like everyone to stream snipe me and we got like 50 default skins basically my subscribers in default skins to all land at loot lake at the same time that was literally insane okay everyone okay look at the noob skins bro oh my god there is so many noob skins there is so many noob skins everyone jump near me on the gingerbread woman Oh my god! Yo, can we get a GG in the chat for this? Now, before we move on to anything else in regards to like the changes around the map, I wanted to show you guys the actual first teaser that has been released by Fortnite Epic Games. You can see this picture here. It's the first teaser image. And you can see it's a picture of the cube. In the cube's reflection, we can see the llama skin. Yes, it's confirmed. The llama skin is coming to Fortnite. Uh, we saw something like this in one of the loading screens, one of the last loading screens that we've had for this season, where we saw the bright uh, bomber touching the cube. And in the cube's reflection was another skin, which look like another version of the bright bomber showing that the cube is going to create some sort of new version of skins in this reflection we can see the the llama skin and the llama has some sort of i don't know i feel like an egyptian feel to it uh the robotic kind of head of the jewels on, on its ear of course you can see the cube lightning bolt across it and then the fortnite season six now as well as that obviously i mentioned the egyptian theme leakers have said that the new battle pass will be in an egyptian theme now i don't know how much we can uh, rely on this i feel like most time the le these leakers are very accurate so i personally believe it but it's obviously down to you uh, let me know your opinions down below on this first teaser uh, i'm super excited man this is the first teaser we have we're still waiting for the official trailer but i'll be showing you some kind of trailer later on in today's video so yeah i'm excited dude it's just insane but as well as the obvious changes are aka the lake there are a lot of subtle changes that are going down around the map that not many people are noticing so i just quickly wanted to name a few of them the main one for me is the runes now a lot of you would not have noticed this but the actual first rune that was ever laid in the fortnite map is currently playing or i guess revealing a sound that is different to any of the other runes that we have not heard before so yes if you go over to this room right here the first room that was ever laid by the cube and listen turn up your volume the sound is is different to any of the other rune and any of this of uh, any of the other sound profiles being played by runes around the fortnite map
Now, what do you guys think this sound is? Do you think it has any connection to the season six storyline or the end of the season five storyline rather? Do you think it has any significance, no significance? Do you think it even matters or do you think it's just a coincidence? I feel like because it's the only rune making this sound that it, it was definitely a change Fortnite added in to give us a clue, but it's just trying to work out what this clue is. Like how does it add up in the, in the long term, in the long big scheme of things? I need your guys help. Let me know in the comment section what you think this sound is and how you think this piece is together to give us a clue on how season five is going to end and how season six is going to begin. Now the rumors are that the next big change to come to the map is actually as well as the lake being covered in this I guess cubed like material the actual rivers that I guess extend from the loot lake are also eventually going to be covered in this material or this bouncy material whatever you want to call it and it's going to spread around the map. This again links into another thing that's happening around the Fortnite map in the fact that the gravitational areas where the runes are placed you know those little domes of like zero gravity the basically the zero gravity areas they are slowly getting bigger uh, this has been confirmed by leak pages that are very trustworthy so we, uh, dude it, we, we're literally a week away from the new season so things are going to start to happen very quickly this week i can almost guarantee it and as well as that leak pages have also said how this final week we will see very soon maybe tomorrow or even today we will see some season six leaks or some sort of trailer like picture as we've seen in the past uh which i think is pretty insane now in a second i'm going to play the actual trailer i've found for season six this is of course a fan made trailer but i think the editing deserves it to be played it deserves some recognition and i honestly think that with the editing and the actual concept within it if you actually look and pay attention i don't think this trailer could be a million miles away of what actually goes down in season six so i'm going to play the trailer i want you guys to let me know your opinion whether you think it's accurate or inaccurate uh but i think it's a good edit trailer and it's pretty accurate in terms of what we know so far so i'm gonna roll the trailer uh let's take a look There we go guys let me know your guys opinions on that trailer on that fan made trailer i think the guy that made this props to him the link will be in the description by the way for the original video uh but it's edited reasonably well you got to think how hard it is to edit to make it look at least a little bit like it is actually from the fortnite game and it is some sort of gameplay from fortnite but also the actual content it kind of makes sense and it kind of goes with a lot of the the, the most popular theories that are going around right now and how season five is going to end and how season six will begin we of course saw the appearance of a dragon in that trailer and i don't think that 
Well, I feel that people that say, no, there's no way dragons are going to come to Fortnite. People that say that are kind of a bit naive because Fortnite, we all know that Fortnite is capable of anything. And of course, we saw in the item shop not too long ago, the ice dragon that was added to the game. And with the whole theory of a volcano or some sort of fire location on the map coming to Fortnite in season six, we all know that dragons are strongly associated with fire, fire breathing dragons. So if we have an ice dragon and then we also have a fire dragon, that in itself makes for a perfect battle pass, a good versus evil we've had the carbide versus omega two opposites in skins good versus evil and then we'll now could potentially have the ice versus fire dragon I i'm not 100 sure that will happen by the way that's just speculation and going off this trailer that we've just looked at like i said leak pages and a lot of people are saying how and well well we know for a fact that we're going to be seeing the official trailer and teasers coming very soon any day now for season six so we're going to know very soon what type of direction season six is going to be going in and those teasers are either going to rule out theories or confirm theories and it would be very quickly as soon as we see these teasers it'll be very we'll be very quick to know like what theories are possible and what theories are no longer possible because of the type of information we've been given so yeah we just gotta be patient and i can't wait for this new season i don't know what you guys feel like but i feel like this season's gone on forever uh, i've enjoyed this one especially towards the end especially of the changes they've made to the lake they've made big changes and they've also made some subtle changes of course well bros the cube what was the cube the cube randomly appeared in paralyzed palms started moving around the map leaving zero gravity areas leaving ruins and i feel like this is the first season where people honestly have no real idea of what is going to go down people have opinions people have theories but no one knows for 100 sure with the meteor event we all knew that a meteor was going to hit fortnite we didn't know in what fashion or how and when and where but we knew it was going to happen in this in this season we literally don't know what's going down like what is going to happen we really don't know so it's really still up in the air i'm super interested i'm loving fortnite and what they're doing with it so far so we just got to stay tuned and we just got to keep keep patient and any day now we're gonna get some leaks and the official trailer so we know what's ever actually gonna happen but anyway guys that is it from today's video sorry for sounding really ill throughout i've actually got a bit of a cold i'm coming out at the end of it so i should be back to normal very soon but if you have watched this far you're an absolute legend make sure you don't forget about the battle pass giveaways i mentioned at the start drop a like subscribe turn on those notifications and just comment anything down below and please comment down your opinions on what you think is happening with season six if you think there's any clues that mean anything more than any of the other ones that we have in the map or we've seen so far just just voice your opinion no one's gonna go against you for it uh, but youtube thank you so much for watching this far it's been all from your boy higgsy stay sexy stay active stay subscribed and i will see you in the next one